Shout Factory TV, changing the channel. I was so worried about it. Well, Allison, what a surprise. Julia, it's so good to see you. That's enough. Let's not wrinkle the suit. Oh, you are holding up well. How's your health? Fine, thank you. Now, I want you to meet Mary Jo Shively. And uh, what is it you do here? Well, actually, I'm an interior design consultant. Really? Your squirt gun is leaking. <laughs> and this is Charlene Stillfield. Hi. And her sister, Carlene. Formerly Mrs. Dwayne Dauber. Oh, and this is my baby girl. This is Olivia. You bring your baby to work with you? Well, sure. You know, most of the time she stays upstairs. Well, we'll just back burner that for now. <laughs> my, my, my. This is not bad. Some new paint and a little carpeting, and I'm just glad to see I haven't been swindled since I single-handedly put together the funding for this acquisition. Oh, I thought they said your daddy bought it for you. <laughs> <laughs> yes, well, he was my primary lender. Without him, I wouldn't have been able to buy the controlling interest. Say, Allison, I don't want to get off on the wrong foot or anything, but... Controlling interest sounds a little strong. What she did was just buy Suzanne's share. A technicality. We'll take it up at the first board meeting. You know, Suzanne was never really interested in working here, and I was told that you weren't either. Well, it's true. I, I never pictured myself coming back to the South and buying a little mom-and-pop shop and taking it to the top. But last week, I, I was standing in the Rainbow Room at the top of Rockefeller Center, sipping my Ramlosa and taking in the lights below. And I said to myself, Allison, it's time to go home. After all, you've made it in New York, and if you can make it there, you can make it anywhere. I guess you're aware that that is actually a song. <laughs>